Hey, I'm uh, just going to take you over to my computer and we're going to dive right in on how to uh, upload something from Creative Fabrica. Okay, so uh, here we are on Creative Fabrica and this is creativefabrica.com. I don't love their main site page. I think the design's kind of like hokey, but whatever. Anywho, so here we are on Creative Fabrica and I've typed in a seller that I follow. So it's Creative KDP. And then I typed in the type of book that I wanted. And like I said, I like a seven by 10 uh, notebook. Um, and I'm just gonna click search. And what happens is all of this person's seven by 10 stuff come up pretty easy, just like a normal search engine. And I'm gonna decide which one I want. Now, because this is for kids, I think they should have a little bit more space. Um, and this is a seven by 10 inch dot lined paper and it says 10 millimeters between the lines. So if I zoom in on it, you'll see that there. This pack includes two dot lined paper, bleed and no bleed, that's for another video, um, for KDP Notebook or Journal. And there is 10 millimeters or one centimeter. The lines are dark and it is a seven by 10 inch. And I don't know what Victorial means. I know that it does save time and it definitely saves money because my money is time. Anyway, that's not the one I'm gonna use because it's a dot lined. We need a lined one. Here we go. Seven by 10 inch lined paper for with seven millimeters. Nope, not big enough for the littles. Uh, seven by 10 inch with three millimeters, also not big enough for the littles. That's a dot grid. Here we go. Seven by 10 inch uh, with 10 millimeters between the lines. That's the one I want. Clickety doodah. Here we go. And download. And it's going to take me right to my download section. 